congenital herpes can cause painful fluid filled blisters that appear in or around the vulva and the vagina. Genital herpes is transmitted by sexual contact and it's caused by a virus called herpes simplex. The symptoms can start quite quickly or they may delay several weeks after contact with an infected person. The person or your partner doesn't show signs of being contagious which is why we recommend using condoms or dental dams as well as avoid sharing sexual toys. If you develop these blisters, they will soon burst and leave red open sores around your genital area. Apart from pain, they may be itchy, tingling or burning and cause very severe pain when passing urine. There is no cure for genital herpes and the symptoms will clear up by themselves. However, going to the sexual health clinic to look at options for treatment and more testing is very essential. For example, you can get painkillers and if it is within five days of the symptoms developing, antiviral drugs which could stop the symptoms from getting worse or shorten the duration of the outbreak. I'd love you to remember these facts about how you can catch genital herpes. It is very easy to pass on from the time you feel the first tingling or itching of a new outbreak before blisters appear right up to when the sores have fully healed. It's possible to pass from skin to skin contact with the infected area including vaginal, anal and oral sex. It is possible to catch genital herpes when there are no visible sores or blisters. If a cold sore touches your genitals by transferring the infection on your fingers from someone else to your genitals, or by sharing sex toys with someone who has herpes.